Range Rover's rear seat entertainment system has the ability to play high quality DVD video through the screens located in the back of the front headrests. Television channels can be watched on the rear screens where specified. Every system comes with a touchscreen remote control which allows intuitive and user-friendly operation. Two wireless digital headphones featuring white fire technology provide high quality sound and clarity to occupants using the rear seat entertainment system. This tutorial covers activating the rear seat entertainment system, adjusting the settings including limousine mode and parental control, using the remote control, playing a DVD, selecting a radio station, and playing a CD. To activate the rear screens, go to the touchscreen home menu and touch the audio video soft key. Then touch the rear media soft key. From this screen, the rear seat entertainment system can be activated, locked or turned off. To lock the system so that use of the remote control in the rear of the vehicle is prevented, simply press the lock soft key. Another press will unlock the system. The rear media settings screen allows limousine mode and TV parental control to be turned on or off. Select the settings soft key. When limousine mode is selected, the rear passengers can control the total cabin audio system via the remote control. TV parental control allows an age limit threshold to be set. If the content of a TV program is unsuitable, a message is sent to the rear screen. To adjust, press the plus or minus soft keys to raise or lower the age limit. To activate the rear seat entertainment system for rear passengers, firstly select which screen you would like to activate, the left or the right. Here we will select left. Now that the left screen is activated we can choose to listen or watch a selected media. For the rear passengers, using the remote control supplied with the vehicle makes it easy to choose and control the media you want to enjoy in the rear seat. The remote is located at the rear of the centre console. Firmly press the top of the remote to unlatch it. Note, do not attempt to pull the remote out of its docked position. When the remote is docked, the battery will be automatically recharged. Rear passengers must wear the wireless headphones to hear all audio information from their selected media. To switch on the headphones, press the power button. The volume can be adjusted by turning the volume wheel. First choose the screen you want to control by selecting the appropriate button on the remote control. Settings for the remote and screens can be reached by pressing the settings hard button. To start DVD playback, firstly insert a DVD. Then choose the I want to watch soft key. All video source options appear on this screen. These include TV, DVD and My Devices. My Devices includes external media such as USB and iPod. Select DVD. To start the DVD, press the Enter button. Press the Pause button to pause. Press it again to play. To seek forward or backward, press here. For fast forward, press and hold. To access the DVD menu, press the DVD menu button. To select a radio station, from the home screen, select I want to listen. All audio source options appear on this screen. Select DAB radio. Press this hard button to seek up to the next available station. To listen to a CD, firstly insert a CD. From the home menu, select I want to listen. This time, select CD. Press this soft key to play or pause the CD. Use this hard button to skip forward to the next track. 
a long press will search forward through the track. Further information on this feature can be found in your owner's handbook. If you require any other help or assistance, please contact your dealer who will be happy to assist.